conservation student, so I go to school to convey stories. I'm more into fine art, however, like more painterly, like less digital. I like artwork as like an emotional resonance to it because um, yeah, it's just more appealing to me, and I feel like it'll be more impacting to people. So I'm more of an expressionist. Um, in particular, it's called neo-expressionism. Um, I wish it to inspire thoughts or acknowledgement of the different personal life wavelengths that we live with. My goal is to produce dynamic images that explore subjects in an impressionistic and expressive manner. I'm easily influenced by ideas and perceptions that people have of various topics or even social matters or emotional matters. Moreover, I enjoy taking these ideas and generating an image that captures a particular feeling or appeal thereby influencing or bringing upon a new awareness to others who view it. I'm not trying to like bullshit aside, like just like just the purest form, but just somebody sees something, they know exactly what it is. They're not trying to like search for it, like an interview. Like you see something, you automatically get it. Or you're like, or it causes like an emotional resonance where you just continuously think about it. And that's kind of like the appeal I try to go for. Like inspire thought, and inspire, and then thereby maybe inspiring action. But I've been mainly a drawer, um, just pencil work and pen and ink maybe. But um, like when I was even in the second grade, I won like um, an art award and even displayed my artwork at the art center. And, you know, my high school was kind of cool. But, uh, the year 2011, I was. Um, Drawing a portrait of this guy at, the, at this New Year's party, <clears throat> and when the ball dropped, like I just told myself, this is like what I want to do, like the rest of my life. Because I just really enjoyed it, like I was just totally into it. <laughs> 